The most intensive land air search in South Pacific history is drawing to a close as hopes fade that the son of New York's governor, Nelson Rockefeller, will be found alive. He swam for shore when his exploration craft capsized and left no clue to his fate, apart from an empty oil drum he used as a float. A companion who stayed behind with the overturned boat was rescued, and he tried to persuade young Michael to await search craft. The 23-year-old scion of one of America's great fortunes, he was a dedicated anthropologist and apparently was held in respect by the natives. 6,000 people and the facilities of three governments were pressed into the search, and when a week passed with only false clues to his whereabouts, hope was all but abandoned. Governor Rockefeller and Michael's twin sister, Mrs. Mary Strawbridge, prepared to return home, as chances that he had reached safety appeared remote. The prayers of all fathers are with the governor in his hour of trial.